Welcome back to the channel guys. I don't know if you can tell I probably sound a little rough or maybe my voice sounds a little different. <clears throat> I have a sore throat of some sort. Uh, my stepmom thinks it might could be tonsillitis. I don't know. I it's just not pleasant. Couple things I want to talk about. First, in the last video when I talked about the triplets, I got a comment correcting me. He deleted the comment though. Probably didn't want to make me look too bad, which I should feel bad because I'm sharing false information. Yes, what I said that can happen. Chances of that very slim. The reason being that the females may not be fertile and they wouldn't be able to birth a calf which makes a lot more sense <laughs> and if in the future if I'm unsure about something I'll be sure to make sure I ask my dad and see if he knows because you all know what happens when you assume um so that's out of the way and yeah let's just get this day started oh next sometime in the future here I am running grain cart for a farm over in York County during for wheat and barley since we're not too busy over over at our farm because I mean we're just it's just the corn corns in the ground we're waiting for corn to grow for us to chop so not sure if this is gonna be a reoccurring thing I think it's just this would be a one-time thing but who knows um, I can't I don't I can't see the future um, so I'm looking forward to that there's also a lot more exciting things coming up this year I'm I'm pumped for it and I'm really excited to share with you guys so all right a whole minute later let's get to work This week is supposed to be very nice. It's not even supposed to get above like 80 degrees, I don't think. It's definitely not above 90. But good weather. I can tell it's humid right now. Um, so I'll take a time lapse of me mowing the front lawn here. Starting about now. by the 4th of July. Well, rude. Uh, the saying goes knee high by the 4th of July, but more like uh, this is over my knee. And then it's only the 14th of June. So, that's how it normally goes, though. This was an earlier spring. We did get done earlier, so this looks like this is going to be some good stuff. 
it's around lunchtime here, and I think I'm, well, I'm not going to go back to eat yet. I'm going to just keep mowing grass. There's a lot to mow. Um, whenever my dad gets back, if he's doing anything interesting, then I'll give him the camera. So I got done mowing grass. It's around two o'clock, and for those that you don't know, that don't know, we started feeding calves and feeding cows around three. So what I need to do now is bring out calves from the maternity up to the hutches, and then I will scrape out this uh, tra transition bar. And I will scrape. I'll scrape out the alleyway. Uh, right now, my dad and my cousin are cleaning out the maternity, so they started doing that while I was mowing. Guess we're gonna, or I'm going to, use the Wacker Newson. second bottle of colostrum so we give our cash two bottles of colostrum so I'm gonna go up and scrape out the transition bar and I have a doctor's appointment I may or may, may have or may not have I said that earlier but uh, doctor's appointment so my uh, brother Thrasher he's gonna Thatcher but he's called the Thrasher in case you guys didn't know so he's gonna feed with my cousin so I'm using the case skillet in case instead of the Wacker Newson because this part right here is too narrow for the Wacker Newson to even latch up to it or hook up to it. And this is the only skid loader that we have that can hook up to it. Our SR250, this is an SR210, but our SR250 can uh, hook up to this, but it just can't latch. So right now my cousin's down there dumping sawdust shavings. Looks like this down in the maternity and then they'll bed up the maternity with straw uh, sawdust would act well sawdust soaks up a lot of the moisture and then gotta be careful what I say here don't want to steal 10th gen thing but and and then uh, the straw would be for comfort reasons Keep it moving, ladies. guys enjoyed the video um, like I said exciting stuff coming up I'm excited 
that means you guys should be excited too, obviously. So, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.